uh, a couple techniques that are real important uh, just I want to mention are um, which Cool Herc used which uh, you know we want to talk about is uh, slip cueing so uh, if I want to drop a, a record slip cueing is this process of kind of going back and forth without you hearing it and then dropping it on beat okay so um, so if I wanted to mix from this record some slip cueing and it and it allows you to to uh, kick in that record um, without it slowing down like if you just start stopped it look at how long it takes to get going so it allows you to get some speed uh, behind that now the other important technique um, just to mention is what's called backspinning which you just saw me do right so the record plays and you spin it back right now you don't want to hear that right but let's say I just want to play this break part and then I want to spin it back to the beginning watch what I do with the fader the fader is set to play this record as soon as I switch it over there see what I say I spun it back to the end of the beat or the break okay so that's back spinning that's just a general mixing technique you, you'll see me do it a lot where you'll see me spinning a record back where I'm actually cueing it back to the top of, uh, of the drum break or the beginning of the drum break or whatever sound I'm going to cut in. So I'm going to use slip cueing, I'm going to use back spinning. And then um, the other technique that Herc did, which, was, uh, which is called um, needle dropping, was uh, he would try to, you know, basically pick up the needle and bring it back to the beginning of the break. Okay, and you pick it up, try to bring it back to the beginning of the beat. It's very hard to do because you're literally trying to pick up the needle and you have this incredibly small diamond tip that you're trying to move two grooves or three grooves or four grooves back to hit the top of the break. It's inc incredibly hard and we'll, we'll go over a DJ um, named Grand Wizard Theodore and um, we'll see a video of him like he's like the master of the needle drop. Okay so I'm going to um, move this camera so I can actually get in here and show you some stuff. I'll do a basic uh, merry-go-round by uh, style for, for Cool Herc then I will show you um, you know like a classic old school uh, DJ just cutting up the same breaks but doing it on time and then maybe I'll, I'll do it with some um, you know more newer styles of, of beat what's called beat juggling um, you know techniques where I flip up the beats a little bit I do a little trick mixing and stuff like that um, and yeah so I just want you to get a sense of how everything works and just kind of see it in real time or <laughs> real time on your sofa or whatever um, you know, because I think it helps so much uh, versus me just talking on about what people are doing. It don't fucking make sense until you see it. All right, so um, we in the studio. Uh, we're gonna do the thing, and yeah, I'm not making gang signs. I'm trying to make like faces and puppets and stuff. Oh, and a heart. How about a heart? <laughs>